injury like what you were dealing with with that right eye? Um, I mean, I wasn't really hurt, meaning the punch didn't bother me. My eyes just started swelling, and I couldn't really... It was giving me a little bit of a problem, not going to lie. You know, I, I, I didn't want the fight to stop. I in the corner. Every time they asked me, can you see? I'm like, yeah, I can see, man. Come on. You know, let's, let's keep the fight going. But uh, I just didn't want to disappoint my fans. To me, that's the most important thing. I want to walk a long ball. Of course, I don't want to lose. But I don't want to disappoint. There's some people that come up and watch me. So many people, as you can see, so many uh, Polish people, so many American people, all kinds of people coming up and, and watching me. I don't want to disappoint them. I don't want them to hang their head and go home. Man, my, my boy, my, my friend, you know, lost. I, 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 I hate that. You know, you never once mentioned, and I'm not surprised because you both, the way you behaved all night long, you never once said anything about your eye. Never once tried to use that in any kind of way. You remind me of a fighter from many years ago, Colin Basilio, after he fought Sugar Ray Robinson, one of the greatest, if not the greatest fighter of all time in his second fight. His eye looked like yours. It was completely close. And newspaper men said to him afterwards, they said, was it because your eye was close? And he said, no, my other eye was good. There you go. That's all I